Not sure if it's been advised yet, but Albuquerque Raw is 5'6", that's a clue. And CS 34 is 5'6", and Albuquerque Raw is 5'6", as well. And for Advisor 49, I'm on Lomas and Gerard, and it looks like ABQ Raw is about to go 5'6", when you guys have seen. And for Around 2 p.m. today, the Albuquerque Police Department found a white GMC truck in the International War Zone District of Albuquerque. They attempted to stop the truck, but the driver fled the scene. Officers did not pursue the truck at that time. The felon, who had no regard for the Albuquerque community, started to drive aggressively and erratically trying to evade the law. He ended up going up central eastbound at a high rate of speed. Witnesses tell us that at some point they saw the truck hit at least three pedestrians in the roadway on Central in front of the International War Zone District Library. APD then authorized a chase of the truck. The pursuit ended at Wantabo and Indian School inside a diversion channel underneath Wantabo between the Blakes and the Arby's. The occupants of the truck were able to escape the tunnel through a secondary tunnel system connecting the main channel. Police locked down the area and began to search the truck and tunnel area. While on scene, we observed the truck to have a missing driver's side mirror and we could see blood on the vehicle on the driver's side of the truck. The blood apparently belonged to one of the pedestrians who were hit near the library. After an extensive search, APD was able to take two people, one male and one female, into custody related to the incident. We went to the Central Avenue scene and observed clothes in the street with a driver's side mirror on the roadway possibly matching the truck that was in the tunnel. We will update what the conditions of the victims are and what, if any, charges the suspect faces when we learn more. You can read about this and all of our other stories at our website, abqraw.com, or any of our other social media sites. Stay safe, Albuquerque.